Now, you know I love a good animal story. I have basically got a med degree in pedigrees. It's time for Dr. Drew Little. All right, we know you can't judge a book by its cover, and now it turns out you can't judge a primate by its cute little face either. The New York Times reports that slow lorises, these cute little guys you love to tickle for enjoyment, are venomous. They carry toxic venom, guess what, where? In their upper arms. I always wondered what this was for. I get it now, venom. <laughs> they raise up their arms and then lick, 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 and then the poison pools, and then they bite, 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 and their flesh rots from the saliva. Ah! Scientists say that they mostly bite each other and males are more likely to bite than females. Huh. Well, hello, that feels like a gender war if I've ever heard one. Look at that guy, big eyes, clear heart, full of poison. <laughs> Speaking of mammals, exhibiting strange behavior, a human man has been spotted flying a jetpack near LAX, which is Los Angeles International Airport, for the second time. People reports that earlier this week, China Airlines spotted the jetpack man at 6,000 feet. And in September, he was flying within 30 yards of an American Airlines jet. Now, listen, jetpacks can't go that high. So are these UFOs? What is happening? 2020! I'm telling you, this is the year aliens could come down and we'd be like, get in line, okay? Get in line for the craziness. Listen, people are nervous about getting on a plane during a pandemic, so maybe it isn't such a bad idea to fly jetpack airways. Do you wanna hang out again? If you do, I guess they say subscribe. But uh, let's do this.